Hey guys, welcome to the tutorials. And in this video, we'll be seeing how to split screen in shortcut video editing software. So I'll essentially be showing you guys how you can uh, insert two videos in a single clip and how you can do that through splitting the screen in two parts. So in the first method, I'm going to use two different videos here. And in the second method, I'm going to teach you guys how you can achieve a sort of mirror effect by splitting the same uh, video into two. Uh, you may have seen this effect in dark intro, the Netflix series intro, and I'll be teaching you guys that as well. But first, let's start by splitting two different videos, right? So the first thing you need to do uh, for creating the split is uh, to create two different video tracks here on the timeline. Uh, I al I've already created the two video tracks, but if you don't know how to do that, all you have to do is right click on the timeline, come to track operations here and click on add video track. Uh, the shortcut for this is control I, but you can uh, just uh, create that using mouse as well. Uh, I've already done that. So let me just import the video as it is. So this is going to be the first video. I'm going to put it in V2 and I'm going to use this as the second video and I'm putting this in V1. Right, so let me decrease the size of this video and there you go. So to achieve split, what I'll do is come to filters, click on plus and I'm already in video effects. So I'll search crop. So once I type crop, I get three options, but go with a rectangle for now. And you can see that the crop effect has been added but you will have to show the software how much you want the crop uh, to be, right? So what I'll do is I'll just click on this square here, this small square uh, in the right of the video and just drag it all the way. But interestingly, you can note that this is still black, right? So to change this, to bring out the second video, what we'll have to do is we'll have to click on transparent. So once I do that, you can see that the second video has appeared here. So this is how you split videos in shortcut. So if I play the video now, you can see that two people are texting and you can add uh, elements here to make it more interesting, but you know, this is how you achieve split in a shortcut. Now, I did promise you guys that I'll show you how you can achieve the mirror effect as well. So let's get to that. I'll just delete both these uh, videos from the track and we have a fresh project. So to create mirror, all you have to do is drag the video that you want onto the first um, a track here, that's V2. Let me reduce this a bit so that, yeah, this should work. Now, again, what I'll do is I'll drag the video once more onto the second track as well. Again, let me reduce the length of this video and there you go. So what you have to do now is add flip to one of these videos, right? I'll flip the first video. Um, so to flip that, what I'll have to do is come to filters, click on plus and type flip. So once I ap apply flip, what will happen is that it sort of rotates the video. It's not rotate, but it yeah flips the video. So now to bring back this uh, video be behind this, again, follow the same process that we did at first. Click on add the filters, type crop, crop rectangle. And if you bring this up here and click on transparent, 
you can see that the second video has appeared right and you can see that it sort of creates this surreal uh, video uh, it's taking time to render but you know you, you get the idea it's it sort of creates this mirror effect and i'm pretty sure you've seen the these kinds of effect in movies as well but yeah so this is how you uh, achieve the mirror effect using the split option now to remove these blocks you can either zoom in or uh, you know change the video settings but either way uh, i'm happy with uh, the whole video and it looks great so that's it in this video guys i hope you learned this cool effect you can apply to your videos as well uh, i hope you experiment more with these videos uh, you can learn a lot uh, by just you know playing around with this effect uh, i hope you learned something new and if you did please do consider subscribing uh, it motivates me to make more of these videos and if you think someone else can use the video do share it with them and uh, yeah that's for now i'll see you in the next video bye for now